Welcome to another video and uh, today uh, I'm going to show you how to uh, install, set up and give you more information about um, AMD's uh, video recording software called uh, AMD Gaming Evolved powered by Raptor and the reason I wanted to do this video is because uh, a lot of people are saying that uh, AMD does not have any video recording features such as uh, NVIDIA does with their shadow play and my answer to that is that AMD does in fact have such software and not only that it's as good as uh, shadow play and uh, if not better because you get uh, reward points like um, which I'll talk about later and another reason I wanted to do this video is because there's been an explosion of uh, streaming channels on YouTube over the past couple of years so and with the AMD gaming evolved uh, app you could easily stream to twitch and uh, so forth so uh, that's another reason I wanted to do this video now before I get started, I want to talk to you about a little bit about uh, the minimum requirements um, to use this application and to record videos and that is you need to have at least a quad-core CPU and a 2 GB hard drive, at least a 5400 RPM hard drive and a GPU that supports uh, DirectX 11 and you need to have a minimum of a Radeon HD 7700 a graphics card and the reason for that is that AMD has implemented um, something called VCE or video code engine and this basically a full hardware implementation of uh, video codec H.264 slash MPEG 4 AVC so that allows at the hardware level of delivering 1080p at 60 frames or 7 so that's something they implemented into the actual hardware itself starting from the uh, 7700 generation and higher so it works much better than software it works much faster and more efficient now um, with respect to their APUs that may also be able to work on it um, starting with the uh, A10 5800K or the 6800K series it may also work on those but uh, I've not been able to test that so I can't uh, verify so just so you know so the first thing you need to do is uh, go to amd.com for slash raptor and uh, download the app now once you download the app you need to right click on the app and the where the app is located in the folder and write and run as administrator and the reason for that is if you don't run as administrator you may get an error that says uh, download failed download timed out and uh, it's asking you to unblock um, some firewall or some uh, virus application is running and that's not actually the reason just need to run as uh, you just need to run as as an uh, admin so what should happen is that after you run and install it, you should create a Raptor account and and sync that to your uh, Steam account, and that should pull in all your games, and you should be able to see those in uh, AMD's Gaming Evolved Raptor application. Now, um, what I'm going to uh, show you next is how to add a non-Steam game or a non-Origin game, and uh, so you could use that um, to record videos or stream to Twitch. So what you need to do is uh, click on the plus button on the bottom left and in this case we're going to choose uh, Need for Speed Hot Pursuit as one of the games so uh, you click on the drop down menu and hit N you'll scroll down to see all the Need for Speed games and, and I select a Need for Speed Hot Pursuit and once you do that it will automatically ask you for executable in this case for Need for Speed Hot Pursuit you'll have something that says NFS11.exe so uh, you're going to uh, click on browse and go directly to your Need for Speed Hot Pursuit folder. In this case, it's on my second hard drive, the D drive, and on the bottom you'll see something that says NFS11. And uh, you're going to select that and uh, hit OK. So after that happens, and uh, you'll get a message that says, Kaching successfully added Need for Speed Hot Pursuit to your game's library. So that now that should be added to your library. So you could just able to just select that game from the left-hand side and uh, click on launch game so uh, that should uh, all your add your games uh, non steam games and now um, if your origin games doesn't get synced you should be able to um, do the same thing by manually adding it and uh, once you launch the the game and uh, just hit control plus semicolon uh, at the point when you want to start recording now one thing that differentiates uh, in this gaming evolved app that's powered by raptor is that um, using that you get uh, various reward points so the more you use it the more reward points you'll get and using that you'll be able to uh, get free stuff uh, uh, get reduction redu reduce pi price on uh, video cards games or uh, get free games 
and uh, various other uh, items that you could get for free and and so basically what I've done is I've added all my games to my gaming evolves app and I just basically launch uh, games from there and you could twitch um, easily directly using the uh, AMD game gaming evolved app and that's one thing that differentiates it uh, it's, uh, that differentiates this software from GameWorks so the more you use it the better so I recommend you add all your games to AMD gaming evolved app and uh, each time you want to play a game or stream just use that and the more you use it the better so uh, so if you uh, so go out and uh, buy a AMD graphics card and start using uh, AMD gaming evolved app and uh, get those reward points so um, if you did uh, like this video uh, please feel free to like and share or uh, subscribe and I hope uh, this video has been informative